सी ए इंटर ज्वाइंट प्रोडक्ट बाय प्रोडक्ट एमसीक्यूज वन ऑफ द पर्पसेज ऑफ अकाउंटिंग फॉर ज्वाइंट प्रोडक्ट्स एंड बाय प्रोडक्ट्स इज ए टू डिटर्मिन ऑपरचुनिटी कॉस्ट बी टू डिटर्मिन द रिप्लेसमेंट कॉस्ट C to determine the profit and loss on each product line, and D none of the above. Now, I, as per me, correct answer is none of them. To be very honest, okay, because the only reason why you apportion joint cost is to value your closing stock of your products, if any. Rest there is no other purpose. There are some very small objectives. and that could be to find out profit and loss on each product also but that is a very small objective as such you try to apportion your cost among the different products so therefore for time pass if you want to find out profit and loss of each and every product you all can be doing it so major objective of apportioning your joint cost is to value your closing stock and ancillary objective could be i guess the c1 that is there that is to find out the profit and loss on each product so as per the given question i think i'll have to be accepting c as the answer yeah that's the correct answer